Yeah. I like to think I'm well equipped as any other average guy But I just can't discover love and I don't even set my standards high On top of that I'm camera shy Maybe I should opt out of the dating pool and be an undercover Tinder samurai Cause I would rather type online than whisper in a dingy bar And swiping left and right could be my new Bushido ninja star I'm well versed in virtual love making ninjutsu On every profile pic I post I'm posing with my shih tzu Or flexing with my shirt off cause I heard that gets you hits too Especially OK Cupid. I'm like arrows of the cherubs be I pierce hearts of women with my cursor and my arrow keys and disregard my Roman roots and choose a find that's serif free. Trust me, I'm a tender bio brainiac. The way I kindle fire with matches, I'm a pyromaniac. A Christian mingle, I'm a Casanova. If y'all don't think so, y'all can ask Jehovah. Check your inbox, he might send an answer over. I wish I had the muscles of a granite sculpture. I would log on Ashley Madison and bang adulterers. I'm so lonely, I've considered farmers only just for someone's arms to hold me. Also, I'm really big on agriculture. But if I had that body of a Grishan god, I would trawl on POF com and use it as a fishing rod and hope I don't get catfish. The fact is, if I did, I'd probably play along because God knows I could use the practice. And if I'm aching for my roots, I'd visit Shadi.com. Message Islamic, Wahhabi, Hijabi, Hadi, Salam. And Sunni, Shia, those are both denominations I respect because I just care for our connection. I don't care about the sex. Sometimes I uninstall my apps in reckless insurrectious rage, then regret it while I check the Craigslist misconnections page. Then I think that I should get out more and disregard my mobile cell, get to know the local teller at my Barnes & Noble well, and check out what she's reading while she's charging up my total sale and ask her if she likes the novel and once she answers ask her if she wants to grab some coffee or some ice cream waffles she'd probably say that's awesome i'd ask her when she's off of work she might answer midnight i'd tell her that sounds awful what a bummer and from somewhere i might muster up the nerve to get her number and i would ask her what her digits are and if i play it right then i can disregard my ninja stars say sayonara to katanas and my other weapons too and try committing by committing online dating seppuku